When you restore a galaxy, the galaxy repository is restored to the state of the galaxy at the time of the backup. This includes object configuration, object deployment states, galaxy-wide configurations, including security, I.O. communications, management, and more. However, this also means that any configuration changes made after the last backup are overwritten and, if needed, must be recreated. Remember, runtime is not restored. Now, let's watch a short video on creating a new galaxy from a backup file. We have our backup file. Now let's create a new galaxy from the backup. We copied our backup into the Orchestra Backup Galaxies folder. Open Orchestra IDE from the Start menu or your location. The Connect to Galaxy dialog box appears. Click New Galaxy. The New Galaxy dialog box opens. Select the Backup Galaxy from the Galaxy Type drop-down. Enter a name for the new galaxy. Remember, because this is a new galaxy, we do not have to keep the backup file name. Verify the GR node name. Click Create. The Create dialog box progress window appears. Depending on the size of the galaxy, this could be a lengthy process. When the progress is 100% completed, click Close. The Connect to Galaxy dialog box reappears. Click Connect. The Orchestra IDE window appears with the new galaxy. This section introduced the process of creating a new galaxy from a backup file, why to use this feature, and what is restored. Now answer some knowledge check questions to test your understanding.